What's going on YouTube? Dark World Mofo here, and we are here with the first episode of Dark World Dual School. Whoever commented Dark World Dual School, I'm sorry that I forgot your name while I'm making this video, but I am kind of in a rush, but once again, congratulations. Um, I really did like the name Dark World Dual School. It, um, it really rolled off the tongue extremely nicely, and um, I really like the name. Um, but I do want to give a huge shout out to everybody else who had some really cool names that commented down below. Thank you for commenting, guys. Um, you guys had some really cool names. It was a really hard decision, but I feel like Dark World Dual School was um, kind of a fun name, and it's really easy to say, and it's kind of fun to say a little bit. So if you guys want to take a second and say Dark World Dual School, um, you might have a little bit of fun. But anyway, guys, episode one is going to be basic Dark Worlds, the old school Dark Worlds. You guys all know this, what I'm talking about, the drag down mind crust build with the recklesses, kind of... Um, what was kind of known to be, I guess this is a little bit Dark World Turbo. Um, Dark World Turbo has definitely changed in um, in its sense um, when people became more innovative and started playing the Malefic Stardust with Advanced Draw, um, with like Absence of Lights kind of way of doing the Turbo. But, um, you know, this is the old school build, and I really thought this should be the first one because this is kind of like the basics of Dark Worlds, man. When you learn to play Dark Worlds, you learn to play the Minecraft Drag Down combo based deck, and it's it's a lot of fun. It can get a little bit boring when you play it too much, but overall, um, overall, this deck is um, pretty phenomenal. It's very basic, um, it's very fun, and it's very controlled as well. So anyway, let's go through it. Three Graph with three Snow, three Brow. I'm playing two Beiges, two Trance, or one Trance, I'm sorry, and two Tour Guides for my monsters. Basic, same with the spells, pretty basic. Three Gates, three Dark, um, dark World Dealing, Drag Downs, Upstarts, and then the Allure, Dark Hole, Foolish. Then for the Trap lineup, pretty standard. Um, three Reckless, you know. I wouldn't really play this card now, but back in the day it was phenomenal. Gaining that advantage when the decks were slower was extremely good. Mind Crush with the uh, Drag Downs is just that that turn one key play you really want to open up with, especially with the Dark Room Monster. Maybe even being able to get a graph a turn one is just is just incredibly good. Or even if you open up with a virus, just like a perfect opening with like a foolish, a snow, a drag down, mind crush, um, and then one of the viruses is just amazing. And then I play Compulse, Solemn Warning, and Torrential Tribute, kinda just for the um little bit of protection. Um, this deck can have some consistency issues with opening up a few awkward hands, or maybe it takes a few turns to kind of being able to set up your plays, but I feel like the uh, Reckless Greeds and the Upstarts help you kind of get to your key plays, and then the Torrential Solemn and Compulse can kind of slow down your opponent if you open up a little bit of a bad hand. But um, what I want you guys to do is I want you guys to comment down your below your thoughts on this deck and um, if you ever played it and what you think of it. Um, I know this build maybe isn't very um, optimal for this format or maybe in the future formats, but definitely back in the day it was uh, it was an incredible deck. Um, I really, really liked it. I played with it all the time. And people hated it when you open up Drag Down Mind Crush and it was so fun to see them upset. But um, let's see, what else can I talk about? Um, this deck had phenomenal matchups. Um, it's really easy to side with this deck in my opinion because you can automatically take out the three upstarts, three reckless greeds for um, your side deck cards. Those add speed to the deck, but when you have to slow down your deck, those are easy, very cards to take out that you can put in your good cards to win your matchups. Um, I like this deck a lot. Um, it's very controlive. Um, most of the time, you're kind of just returning and bouncing with Graph and poking in for that damage. You can definitely do some ridiculous plays as well um, with this deck. You can still do the Levy Year into first turn um, Graph a play. Setting up your Mind Crushes is really, really good. I don't want to keep this first episode running too long. I know I'm talking a lot, but I just kind of want to do this one as a little bit of a test run. I'm not going to talk about this build too, too much because you guys pretty much all know what it is. But when I get into like the Creator build, the Turbo build... um. Maybe even an Archfiend build in the future, if I can um, acquire those cards. I will be doing very detailed explanations. But you guys, you guys know the um, the standard Dark World build pretty well. I don't think there's too too much to explain. But I did hope you guys enjoyed this episode. Please make sure to look out for more um, of these. I promise I'll have more coming up. Sorry that I haven't been uploading videos lately. I've been extremely busy. Call of Duty Ghosts came out. I also wanted to say that if you guys play PS3 and you're playing Ghosts, make sure to add me. You guys already know my name. And my name is Dark World Mofo. Add me and we can play a little bit. I actually met a subscriber on um, PS3 um, out of out of nowhere. Somebody just started saying my name in the in the lobby room, and I'm like, whoa, what the hell, it's a subscriber, and it was, it was a really awesome feeling, and I would love to play with my subscribers on Call of Duty, have a little bit of fun, get to know you guys a little bit, that'd be awesome, so if you would like to do that, make sure to add me, send me a friend request to Dark World Mofo on PS3, and we can play some Call of Duty Ghosts together, but anyway, guys, off topic, I know. Thank you so much for watching this video, I hope you guys enjoyed it, um, Standard Dark World, um, a beautiful deck, a deck that I would love to bring back and um, make it good again, I just gotta figure out, maybe change a few things, um, 
And like I said, guys, comment down below your thoughts. Comment down below what deck you would like me to go over next. I really felt like um, Turbo should have been the first one, but I could do um, Creator. I can do the new and improved Turbo with the Malefic Stardust Advanced Draws. I could do... Um, I might be able to do the Arch Fiend. I have a few other in mind I can do. I can do a Control of Trap Heavy deck. I can do whatever you guys would like. Thank you so much for watching. Make sure to please give this video a like. Comment down whatever you guys want to do. Add me on PS3. Thank you so much for watching. Dark World Mofo out. Bye, guys.